Look, it, it, it was one of the toughest games I think I've been a part of. Obviously, every Suncorp Super Netball game this season has, has been really, really tough. But I guess winning in front of so many amazing Swiss fans at Kudos Bank Arena, it was phenomenal. It was a hard-fought match right down to the last centre pass, literally. And look, it's no better feeling to stamp our authority on, on the derby. Yeah, we knew it was going to be a physical game, but whenever we step out on court against any team, regardless of who they are, we know it's going to be a physical, tough battle. I think potentially on Sunday it was maybe a little bit more physical than you would expect, but I know for me, I quite enjoy a physical game and Paige is able to stand up and, and take those hits as well. So for us, it was just about you know maintaining our composure, staying connected as a team and just getting on with the job. And, and we did a really good job of that. And I know it took us down to the last... 90 seconds or something to get ourselves in front but we got in front when it mattered and we were able to hang on so i'm really proud of the girls particularly this one here who had to take a few hits but you know that's just the way the game goes and we just get up brush ourselves off and continue on yeah look every week is going to be super tough we obviously know that um every point counts this season and we obviously want to get as many as we can each week and i think going down to the wire is super exciting for fans um obviously a bit more <laughs> nerve-wracking for us on court but as we said, we just want to stick to process and uh, in that moment, I guess on, on Sunday, we stuck to our process right at the end and we got the win. So for us, we go out there and we want to win comfortably every week. But if it comes down to the wire, you know, it's really proud and to know that the girls can stick at it for 60 minutes and get that win in the last, you know, 90 seconds. So for us, though, we want to go out and play our best netty right from the first quarter. And I think we haven't seen that yet and we've been a bit inconsistent, which has actually led to those one goal wins at the end. So we obviously want to really start from quarter one this week against Perth and, um, you know, have four consistent good quarters. I think both wins we've had so far this year have really boosted our confidence just to know that we can finish out games and I'm sure it's boosted our fans and members confidence in our ability to do so as well so for us we're, we are running on a bit of confidence at the moment but in saying that we also know how good we are as a team all 10 of us uh, so to know that we can put anyone out on court we can get the job done regardless of who it is and regardless of who we're playing so we've got options across the court and you know fever are going to have to do a little bit more homework on us than we have to do on them because they're going to have to look at all 10 of us as opposed to us only having a look at seven so yeah it we're definitely running on confidence leading into fever especially heading over to perth so it's always tough playing over there and they're obviously a quality side they haven't dropped a game yet this year and they've got a couple of really big name players in their team that are doing a really good job for them so it's going to be a tough one for us but hopefully if we as Paige said stick to our processes we can get the job done.